I would get out there and I didn't see him nowhere and I wanted him to come where I was. I'd get out there and get my bottle and I'd start blowing. That's it. Exactly, he'd pick his up, he'd go to pooping back in, I know I heard it. Chopping greens, collard greens, all I chopped was collard greens. I got four row potatoes in there, a uh, row of butter beans, and a row of okra, a row of peanuts, and I planted some watermelon in the, in the skips in the peanuts. I don't dislike no town, but you just can't raise nothing in this city to live on or to eat. Both the houses be so close together, you can't play nothing, there's no garden or nothing there. And that's why I like to stay in the, in the country where I can raise my garden and have something to live on. Mm, you got and that right. Some peas, because I don't know how they want to go pee. Mm, no, I believe it's going to be a rough one. Yeah, it's going to be rough too. I tell you, some rainy days. Look like every day you get hungry, then you can't get out you nowhere. You do eat more when it's raining, you, you can't then. get out nowhere. You got it there, you gonna go back in there and go to eating then. That's right. Yeah. That's all I want something to eat. <laughs> want something to eat and let it be decent and clean. I like to share with other folks. That's the tally God give me to give. And I don't just say I have a hard way to go through the world in no time. Look like I have an easy way. Look like somebody always, little or much, putting something in my hands. And it be the bad thing, I be one. Well, I love the canes. I can stay in the kitchen from morning to night, can you? You can make a party there for peach parties if you want them. Or you just can put them in a plate and eat them with a spoon. That's the way I would eat them. And have some good biscuits this winter. And have some butter in the biscuits, it'd be good. When I was a child coming up, sometimes she didn't have the sugar to cane her and with. But she just put them up airtight to cold. And when she get the sugar, she would sweeten them when she go to eat them. That's the way I do it. Nicholas, Nicholas. Dime is a dime. How's full of children they ain't now in mind? She got the bone, let them go. Some old brooms here. Yeah. I said, Well, I'm gonna take one of these wires off now. I'm gonna try it. Put on a tree out there. Couldn't get no sound on it. Mac, I put it upside the wall. That's where I got my music at, right there. Many people use Pearl Drops tooth polish instead of toothpaste. But some of you ask if Pearl Drops is okay to use every day. Well, it is. Two tests prove it. First, Pearl Drops was shown to be more gentle to tooth enamel than the leading toothpaste. Second, polishing with Pearl Drops does not scratch enamel any more than brushing with plain water. And Pearl Drops' exclusive soft polishing system helps get teeth their whitest. Pearl Drops. It's gentle, but it really works. Hello, I'm the steak supreme chef. What are you doing in my dining room? I'm getting people to try new steak supreme. Different stories I watch, but really, no preacher come on of what I, I don't watch. Because I can't read and can't write. But if he preached the Bible, I don't heard the Bible enough to know when he right and when he wrong. Louis, he don't care too much about it. By TV, he loves the radio. That's his talent, radio. Sometimes, twice a day, sometimes once a day. I go up there and get water for the cane with the medicine. I had to tote all my water just about. Well, 
Tomorrow, you can't serve God and the devil too. The blues, rock and roll, ain't no, ain't nothing to save you if you come to die. And he say he ain't no different than the blues and the church songs and to him, but it is different in them to me. I'm always adding about the blues. I love church gospel, and he love, love rock and roll. See? And that's different, you know, I am, yeah, but yet and still we get slow, all right. But Grudel still back up the road up here. That way he first he saw me, and that way the first I saw him. And fell in love and married. You know, sometimes the Lord has something pointed out for you. Have sort of good husband pointed out for you sometimes. And me and him get along fine. I have to buy... Meal, flour, sugar, coffee, lard, meats, feed from my, I got two hogs, I had to buy feed for them, and I had to buy feed for my chicken, and stuff like that. Well, y'all come back to see it. Yeah, if you get a chance to come to the market, you Yeah, for sure. How you been living, bro? I've been doing pretty good. How you been doing? Oh, pretty good. Yeah, I've been doing pretty good. Well, I do sometimes, but I tell you, it's just thankful to the Lord I'm still living. That's right. Because there's so many dead and gone, they wouldn't even see. <laughs> That's right. And you're more than starved to death, yeah. I'm going to tell you the truth. Because <laughs> part of the time, I couldn't get me nothing to eat. Because right. I had certain things to eat. That's right. Doctor right. put me on certain things. Mm -hmm. That's right. I'm telling you. But I thank God I'm still here. Okay. The more that stuff you drink, the more you want to drink it. You know how I get my whiskey? A gallon. I'm putting no half a pint. Ain't been so long before you've been getting that old wine by the gallon. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell that lady that old man. All through the night. You walk off and leave that star and throw it down here. <laughs> I just rather be in the country than be in the town. God take care of me every day of my life. Not only me, everybody. He got the angels guiding us around every day. I believe that. And he shakes us and wakes us up in the morning. His angels.